Sanbonan Maswatla Mashe. Welcome, Edigo. I am your host, Ayanda Shope, from the Ministry of Agriculture under the Home Economics Section. Sipegela Lapage Ego Poleni, Garden Villas, Jengoban Bonangel Kishilet for Lishega Kulu, Namusha Stabesenda Tin Shobon Shobo Degusha Lok Shugene. Our goal for this program is to just always promote healthy eating and to just make sure that in Pega Pela different dishes using healthier methods of cooking to reduce Emma health issues. Lasa Konanya Lusiati Gutsignabo obesity, Nema non chronic diseases. So we are trying to just eliminate that. So basically, Namosha Sitawenda Emma healthy chicken meals. I'll just show you a variety of meals that you can prepare using your chicken. Let's start pega genamosha, stowenda emma chicken breast stir fry, siben emma chicken kebabs together with our Greek salad and rice. We're gonna serve everything that we'll prepare today with rice with vegetables. So nyalon jingoban bona on display. I have quite a number of ingredients. Firstly, I have my chicken breasts. Nyabona genan got mashega kulu afresh. My white onions, this is about one and a half cups of your onions. Different types of green peppers, we've got green pepper, red pepper together with our yellow pepper. Then we've got our spices here. This is crushed chili. This is paprika, it's about half a teaspoon. Then this is one tablespoon of cumin. We also have more here, we've got our mixed herbs. This is half a tablespoon. Salt is one teaspoon. Then ground pepper, ground black pepper, it's half a teaspoon. Then here, it's your Portuguese spice. It's one and a half tablespoons. Then we've got our olive oil. It's about a cup. Then this is our chicken sauce. It's about a quarter cup. Ne lemon juice which is also about a quarter cup. So on the Emma ingredients eightful in Rabona Golap, as you can see, it's fresh vegetables together with our meat. Ayatola gala guma okay foods la corna eswatin. So nyalo stoutala ng chicken stir fry yetfu. Lek fanele ugwende make sure but you've got your bowl right next to you. So I will just use my bowl here because I have to mix our liquids first together with our spices then dip our chicken breast and then just grill them a bit in our pan and then just add my vegetables so ngdawcalanga cooking oil wami which is olive oil ngshiye a bit because i will need to fry my onions nglanzele lemon juice And then my chicken sauce. If you don't have your chicken sauce, it's up to you. You can use your sweet chili if you like it, or your barbecue sauce, guguwe. And then I'll just stir it up a bit, jengobanbona, just to make sure for flavor. And then I shall add my spices. I'll just add them all at once. So all the spices together with our herbs, nali liquid it just enhances flavor. So stawkota inya mayetfu ule mix chale. So we'll just stir it up. Jengobanati e chicken e healthy gakulu and it's got several benefits to it. Some people, most of the time, they find that they consume a lot of chicken because it's much more affordable. And naso funzi segi pega in many different ways, you definitely will enjoy it. Okay, kisha seklange nelana. So we'll have to dip our chicken. Like we won't cut it into pieces, we'll just cut it up later. So just dip it and make sure that it's well coated. So 
it be well coated whilst your pan is getting heated up. And this marinade on I seven days later on, especially when we are frying our vegetables here. It's a non-stick pan, so ningetugi. So you can just mix it up a bit, stir it up so that your meat can be cooked. It's important to go to Songa's card, see the inya malepe gegate, moba pela a spoon, besses tolati for me go to a see the inya malena food fagas. My meat is ready, Sonia long day keeper epan in lami. It's juicy, it's looking good, and I bet it's very tasty. Now we get pegela ekayambugeli. Just make sure that you practice often and prepare different kinds of meals that your family will enjoy. So nyalo, we shall just slice it up because we want to make strips. Okay. So Google we go to we sigaranganani. You can see it's done. Well done. So you can just do that. Or even smaller pieces, it's up to you. This will serve about four people. So nani ngati bala emakaya gutin bangaki. Nyaloge will heat our stove again and then just fry our onions. You can just use the oil that you were using. Anya neswe it was shitoguti, it's about a cupful. My stove is getting hot. Sheshes she sinjangoban bona. So nyalo, we're just going to saute our onions together with our peppers and then dip our meat for the very last time. But just because we don't want to overcook our vegetables together with our meat because it's already ready. So and just put them in your pan and then fry them. So our onions are starting to change color. So nyaloge says ngafaga our peppers. I'll add my green together with my yellow and red peppers. And then stir it up. It's looking good. So I shall just dip my meat here on our plate. And you can see all the juices are now left on my chopping board. But I'm sure the meat is very, very tasty. So just saute that a bit. And then I will add my chicken. So there you go. And this is just a complete meal. You can just consume it as is. And the browning of the chicken makes it look much, much more appealing. So yes. There you have it, our chicken stir fry. Later on, how will you plate it up so that you see the complete dish? OK stores have consistently aimed to be the retailer consumers can count on. Make OK Foods a store of choice for a one-stop convenience shopping experience at the best prices. We are committed to provide unwavering savings, quality products, and fresh season produce. OK Foods, we're here to make your day OK. Ekupoleni Garden Villas is an elegantly modernized guest house situated in the heart of Eswatini in Manzini. 
The guest house provides luxurious and tranquil accommodation that will make you feel you were somewhere special from the moment you walk through the door. This impressive residence offers gracious accommodation, warm hospitality, and exceptional care. If you like swimming and relaxing, it is an ideal place to stay with a private outdoor pool and serene garden. For those that love to stay fit, there's a standardized eight grade gym to keep you in shape. We also feature a full-size pool table for full entertainment. Our restaurant will provide you with good food and a good mood. Ekupoloni Garden Villas is the best alternative to ensure you and your family and friends will enjoy a cultural paradise. Ekupoloni Garden Villas. Come in as a guest, leave as family. Nyalo ge etigo stowe na e Greek salad yetu. Njengo banbona, we've got our lettuce, our red onions, feta cheese, our salad dressing, black olives, together with our cherry tomatoes. But ngalanga be ute ema cherry tomatoes, you can just use tomatoes that you have at home. And you can also add cucumber if you like. So this is what we'll use for our vegetable. It's always important to use the vegetables on a daily basis. And then below, I will have to defend it. So we will use the vegetables. Especially if you are cooking a full or complete meal. So let's start with the It's very simple. I'm sure people have prepared this at home. So it's just a quick reminder on how you can prepare your Greek salad. So make sure what the lettuce ya ko ishobile iwashiwe jengo banbo na lapa. It does have traces of purple, so it's up to you. Snayo if lettuce le purple, ganye na le na le si try le le shat. And as katin la listening, bamfu ba e ba e chop e ba e shred e ibe ingane ga cool. Unga gwenda na logo gepa asikutat na logo to the more you keep chopping your real green leafy vegetables let it go the yadni pabe seti seti salagule yo chopping pot lo is seven this up so we always advise that just try to just shred it like this it's up to you uto leave a pela lil stem begashe it's quite quick and if you like you can also include the stem ngoba pela gwenda iletis yako ibe very very crunch na lo guti na ngabe pela i see neng in jenga leye tfu we are the pelagos nanga benji, we go bega so, it our vele, it bugege in nang in our yeast. And you'll just get the best from your lettuce salad. So just shred it with your hands as much as possible because we are going to eat other vegetables. Nyaibo nanjaguti, it's very fresh. And always cover your green leafy vegetables in your fridge. Guza guzi pela angadobe abun. So that is how much we're going to use of our lettuce. Basic is to get the red onions eatful. If you the Emma red onions, you can always use your white onions. Siat ke gus labanye bamfu abawa tanzi Emma onions. So you can just omit them and maybe add your apples. It's up to you. And nangabe Emma nanji are in season. You can also add Emma nanji ako. Nyabona already. Imi bala se talakshangana. We've got our green together with our purple. You can also add your black olives. We do have uh, your green olives, but we decided to settle for black olives. They're quite tasty, and they are deseeded. So ungawatola e OK foods together with your fresh vegetables. We also have our cherry tomatoes. So just add a couple of those. And lawa ngwatanza ngalo guti ayaleganje. They're not like agatualum lomo a snack on it and you can always add your feta cheese so you can just mix it up okay gendega ke kuthi bese lama vegetables leswange tile ashona le phasi but don't be discouraged because the more you mix it up the more adobe langa pan. And if you like, you can add more of your onions. Then we do have our salad dressing. 
and you can use any salad dressing you can make your own but we decided to just use this one today it's quite a simple dish, so make sure you do make such and consume it. For your lunch break at work, you can just pack your salad and have a small container for your salad dressing so that you're able to have it for your lunch or as your snack, it's up to you. It will give you energy and it's quite a healthy meal. We also have our spices here, our vegetable seasoning. It's about one tablespoon. Our salt, it's um, half a teaspoon, uh, one teaspoon. And then here we've got our black pepper, a quarter pinch of your teaspoon together with your barbecue sauce uh, spice. It's actually one tablespoon. We also have our olive oil together with our pineapple juice and our skewers too that we're going to use since we're making chicken kebabs so this is all we'll use for our kebabs kebabs more vegetables together with more fruits you can include your mangoes together with your grapes and google are you grilling it so just make sure that you try it out at home so let's start we're going to take our oil and just add it here we just need this to coat our chicken together with our pineapple juice and then our spices just add them up in your oil it's more like a marinade that you can use for your chicken because you can see that um, we haven't done anything to our chicken so we want it to be tasty make sure that you remove everything else that you do not need and then just stir it up till it's well coated and this will help because it will make your kebabs very moist together with just being very flavorful and if you like a kick of chili it's up to you you can add chili so next make sure that you have your casserole dish that you'll use for your oven together with your foil to just cover it up so that it doesn't dry up and if you have a bry stand at home and maybe you're having a bry then you can just make your kebabs and then just put them in that bry stand from your bry stand so now what we'll do first make sure that you start with your onions onions because they're thick and they also have color so I'll just demonstrate two. So just make sure go to you use your skewer and then just put it as I have. And you can also add your peppers. It's simple to make. And also your pineapple, depending on how big your chunks are, it's up to you, but the thicker the better. And then you can just include your meat. So make sure you see it's a bit thick so that you're able to just put it here. So continue with the process. Make sure you don't uh, poke yourself with this. Oh, I have to put my pineapple. Just follow the sequence so that it can be even. And then just place it aside and continue with your onion and you can just enjoy this as a snack or as a finger food depending on that kind of event that you're having at home maybe you're having a mini party so do try it out at home i'll just demonstrate how to make two and then the rest you can try it out at home but we do have a couple that we prepared um, before so we'll show them later how it looks like so it's simple to make and i'm sure children will enjoy this because they'll be quite handy in the kitchen they'll help you out so yep this is it this is how you prepare your kebabs and then we're just gonna 
put them in our casserole dish and then place them in our oven. Now I get my kebabs ate for segavele are ready. So we shall just remove this and just clear our surfaces. We'll just shift it in front. If you've got some chicken left, then leave it over for leftovers. So you can take your casserole dish and just line all your chicken kebabs. No much just a few, depending on the number of people that you will be serving. So just line it up. And one last one. And you can add a few that side, that's still okay. Well, they all fit. It's really looking great. I love the colors and hopefully it tastes great. So naige i marinate yetfu. We'll just drizzle on top of our chicken breasts because pela asfun guti i flavor yale pineapple besaseba altered. So just drizzle a bit. Try to be a bit patient and just drizzle some of that marinade on your chicken. And even if it drops, don't worry. It will just add more juices to your casserole dish. So it's quite simple and it looks great. So now so drizzle chili, you can then just take it to the oven. And basically that's it. We can now just take it to our oven, but make sure that you cover it up with your foil. Because the goose pella le moisture it over retain. Emma chicken breast ako it over very moist together with your pineapples and your onions with your peppers. So there it is. Just cover it up, and then now we shall take it to our oven. Make sure that you preheat your oven first so that by the time you just insert this in, already the oven is fast, fast. So let's go there. Okay, we shall just leave it for a couple of minutes. I don't want to get burnt. So lastly, I'll just display all the foods that we prepared today together with our starch because pela nanga besilja gutla go it was yet kuzik fanelek be balanced sibe na e protein together with our vegetables and our starch and with our starch it's just rice that will be mixed with our vegetables so I'll just show you quickly then we just display everything else. Eti gosa sin pegele gutla logum nanzin jengoba nyabona. We have our chicken kebabs together with our chicken stir fry, our Greek salad, ne rice yet for pelalesi fage emma vegetables add food, which is peas and your carrots. And if you like, you don't even have to cook your carrots, you can just add them as they are because we do enjoy that crunch. So make sure that you prepare your healthy chicken meals and use proper methods of cooking so that you get the best from the dishes here. So make sure that you tune in all, always on Fridays at 7.30. So for me, goodbye.